Oh, 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 no. oh, no. oh no! Santiago's watching this like. <laughs> Hey, I'm Sina Ortiz. Hey, I'm Coco Quinn. Hi, I'm Karis. Hi, I'm Halo Blanc, and we're the cast of Chicken Girls, and we're with 17 playing superlatives. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to 17's YouTube channel. Funniest is probably... Karis. Karis is like so funny. Like whenever she's reading her lines, like we all have to like redo it so many times because we just start laughing. It's like so funny. I would say the funniest is me, Coco, and Corinne. Every time me and Coco are on set together, we can never write the line straight. It's like we're always just laughing. I don't know what's Literally. funny. It's nothing. Nothing is ever funny. I just think we just laugh. It's really yeah. bad. It's contagious. Like everyone's like, it's funny. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's definitely moi. I'm very good. Oh, Eliana. Oh, yeah, Ellie. Oh, yeah, Eliana. Eliana, yeah, Eliana. Eliana is so good. Yeah. Tsunami, she's like. Um. <laughs> and Eliana. Yeah. And yeah. Sky, really good dancer. She's really good. There's this thing where she can like turn and she'll throw her back like like a C, oh. a litter of the C. She'll go. <laughs> yes, that's what Eliana does. It's scary. It's creepy. Yeah. Honestly, everyone's like not bad at dancing. They're actually good. So mostly everyone. Everyone has their own little flow or their rhythm, you know. But definitely, I would say Aiden, Eliana, Corinne, Coco, Tsunami. Kaylee. Okay, let's just say everyone. Yeah, everyone. <laughs> everyone. Ooh. 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 Coco. Because, like, she's this, like, un <laughs> like un unapologetic. That's the word. And she's just super, like, her. Like, she doesn't care about what anyone thinks. She just does it. And she's super funny in the show. And, you know. Coco's super funny. <laughs> Coco's super funny. <laughs> I think everyone can say that. The whole cast can say that Coco is just like her character. Like she's basically yeah. paying herself. Yeah, me and Tsunami. <laughs> you guys really are like you're just characters. I would definitely say Tsunami. <laughs> because <laughs> No! <laughs> I was gonna say tsunami. <laughs> because you're super rom you're super romantic. You like your like your first date would be like on a picnic or like something super fancy, like a hopeless romantic, like in the movies. Like I'm not saying like you're begging for a, like a man's <laughs> but like still <laughs> It's definitely tsunami. I mean I think everyone I think everyone can see that. Okay, yeah. okay. I see where you get that from. Definitely and tsunami. Pro I probably witnessed it. I witnessed it. Really? Definitely. Definitely tsunami. Okay. <laughs> um, I've seen it live. It was really funny to watch. But I did it yesterday. I texted him and I wrote an entire freaking paragraph. He, he never responded. Oh my god. <laughs> is it who we think it is? It is it. Is it? Is it? Tsunami, is it? Oh, oh, no. No. oh no! I love how we all know what this is and no one will ever know what it no, is. That's no, so funny. I know I've embarrassed myself in front of my crush before. I mean, who hasn't? Probably just did it like not two seconds ago. But like, whenever I'm like just like filming, like, and he'll be there, and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh. The most likely to obsess over the crush is Tsunami, period. There's not really an ending there, it's just Tsunami. I, I obsessed just a little, just a little. Definitely Tsunami, but like <laughs> me, I just like overthink things. I'm like, oh my god, yeah. like I just overthink, but it was, it's, <laughs> it's 
probably Tsunami. Tsunami or Corinne. I just feel like those two will like oh, yeah. freak out. Okay, so 99.9% .9 me. <laughs> yeah. I would still probably say tsunami, which has never happened before. Yeah, tsunami. I'm not that Maybe. hopeless. Maybe I'm not that hopeless. Yeah. Come on, it's not even funny anymore. <laughs> She's like, I can't do this. <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like Aiden would just secretly. I feel like Aiden doesn't tell anyone who, that, who he really has a crush on. Then you just like you can like tell like is she gonna be your best friend? Like the person who would secretly have a crush on their best friend would probably be. Enzo. Mm -hmm. Person most likely to come up with a ship name is, um, I wonder who's at the bottom of my screen right now. I can't really see her. Um, <laughs> Tsunami. I've done Maybe a Sky. Lot. Sky could come up with a good uh, ship name. Yeah. Oh yeah, she definitely would. I feel like Sky would just like a very creative person that I feel like she's just gonna like say like on the spot or something. Definitely. Oh yeah, she'd be like. <laughs> um, I would say Haley or Sky. Oh Haley and moi. I can't say it, but moi. Moi. <laughs> <laughs> No, I don't feel like anyone, but like maybe in the show, like Claire. And I'm gonna say maybe Haley. Yeah, maybe Haley. Because <laughs> every time, like we're like around Haley, I feel like her question, I always hear her say, How's your love life? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. No, I'm trying to match you guys with me. <laughs> no, okay, me because it's one time my brother had. Um, one of his friends over and it was a girl and I'm like I go up to my brother and I'm like yes. Diesel. Yes. I'm like Diesel, Diesel. you're gonna go over there and you're gonna go talk to her go Diesel. that is go. not allowed I am the hey, only Diesel. girl he can hang out with no. <laughs> Diesel loves me by me and Haley's orders Diesel that is not me. okay <laughs> <laughs> You. <laughs> Me and Coco are packed. We go with pranks, okay? We can get people so good. On the second half of Chicken Girls, we already have ones. We already have plans from the other one. It's it's gonna be really good, but I would say me and Coco. When we're on FaceTime, we literally have our mom bags and we pack for pranks. Like, we're so good at them. Like, no one can beat us, we're great. I think Haley and Coco, but one time on set, we were like at lunch and Tsunami was like going downstairs or something to do, I don't know what she was doing. And so Haley like hit like, in some tables or something, oh. and she came out while she was walking up the stairs, and she just scared it. And we were all just oh yeah, it. it was at lunch. It was at lunch, and I, I said I'm about to go scare them. And of course, Coco had her video camera out first. She was like, yes, <laughs> um, but yes, she did. She did. And everyone started recording me as I hid behind some chairs while she walked down up the stairs. It was so funny, and everyone was eating lunch, and we were all screaming. All screaming. And everyone filmed it. I went to go get a charger, and I was gonna whack. Haley with it because you freaked me <laughs> out. Good thing I scared you. Yeah. <laughs> she was gonna whack you. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like it would be like Corinne for some reason. She's just always so excited to like share stuff. Yeah. And then it's like, oh, or um, or Coco. Yeah. Maybe <laughs> Corinne, Enzo, or Santiago. Yes. Definitely. Santiago. Yeah. I would, Santiago definitely. Yeah. Santiago is watching this like. <laughs> <laughs> Coco, sometimes, sometimes she's just like five minutes late. And I don't know, I, I people are like, that's so weird. Like you're either so late or you're so early. And she's always just like, maybe like 15 seconds before her, after her call. And we're just like, here she is. <laughs> Most of the things that I do is in like LA. 
and a lot of my friends are in LA and I live down at Newport near the beach so it's like an hour and a half away so that's mm -hmm. what I can blame it on also I get Starbucks too yeah. I feel like it's Coco like just cause like it's always those times like when I like wait, anything it's weird I feel like it's like Taco Bell okay, it takes me like a couple hours to get ready so I blame it on you know what I'm just always late there's just no excuse okay, I will say me there was a one time, me, me, Karina, and Haley, we were having a sleepover. We were going to Haley House. Mind you, I was supposed to be at Haley House, what was it, like 5 or 6 p.m.? Mm -hmm. And I got there like at 10, but I had excuses, okay? First, I was getting a facial, but then... Okay, I wait a second. Wait a second, Karis. You <laughs> told us that someone in the family, you were going to Target for them, and you oh, were oh, in yeah. Target, you were in Target, and they were like, hey, are you out of Target? And you were like, no, I'm in the car to go to Target. And we were like, <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but I was really, I was really going to Target. Okay, so I had to film a video. And I filmed a video, but the video took like extra long because Alexa wasn't working. <laughs> Alexa? <laughs> she really wasn't working, okay? We needed to get that video done because we, it was due that day. And so then we got in the car. And mind you, Haley lives like an hour away. Oh, I do live pretty far. I was like three hours late. <laughs> so I would definitely say Tsunami because like she's always in something really fancy. Like look at her right now. She's literally in like a tube top. And I'm in like a regular shirt. Obviously Karis. <laughs> A hundred percent. I would say Karis. Like her hair is always like on fleek with her chains and her earrings and like her whole yeah. outfit. Also, Tsunami has a lot of cute clothes, and I love Haley's closet. Like whenever I go over, I like just put on her clothes. I will say all of us: Tsunami, Coco, Haley, and Skylar. One hundred percent. I feel like everyone has like their own like good ways of style. Like yeah. everyone's so different and unique in their own ways, which mm -hmm. I love. And everyone is just so cute with their clothes. And Aiden. Aiden has. The best Aiden clothes. Like, I will steal his closet any day. Probably Tsunami. I don't know. Karis usually either starts the conversation, but then doesn't like end them. She's just like, okay, peace. I never start oh. the conversation. I feel like conversation. I'm the worst at texting because like we all have this chicken girls group chat and I never answer. <laughs> never. Yeah, we all true. You answered it like twice. Really because I have it on do not disturb. They text like 2,000 times a day. So I have it on do not disturb. <laughs> so does it end up. The worst texter will probably be Haley and Coco. I feel like <laughs> Nami. Haley was <laughs> terrible. It's just because we're on FaceTime half of the time. We're just like, oh, they're texting. Let's put it on do not disturb. Yeah. It honestly just depends on what group chat it is. See, I respond to the one yeah. on Snapchat, just not the one on messages. <laughs> I would definitely say me. And I would say all of them, but the people that would like really plan it and be the ones who are like, we're doing a reunion, would definitely be like Coco, Tsunami, Karis, Eliana. Maybe Aiden, I feel like he'd be like, yay, let's go to the beach. I feel like Santiago is most likely to plan the reunion because he's the one who planned for us to go like to City Walk. And it yeah. didn't work, but <laughs> it, didn't work. It, it did not work. I would say either Haley, me, or um, mostly everyone, because everyone like tries hard to see each other. It would definitely be Haley. She's one of those adorable people. Um, Haley, Coco. Guys, come on, Sky. Yeah. yeah. Oh yes, Skylar. Skylar. Yeah. Come yeah. on, she would definitely yes. be Skylar. like, let's Skylar. go to Disney World, and we'd be like, yes. Coco, Tsunami, Karis, Eliana, those are the four girls. There. And Santiago. Santiago's be like... Yeah, Santiago can dance. Santiago nice. can hit those moves. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like Tsunami, she would be a flyer since she's like really tiny. So. Also, I could see Aiden like doing some flips and stuff across the grass. I, I don't know. It's like, I feel like Corinne, but she'd be like that really sassy one. The one that's yeah. like, I don't want to do this, but I'm still going to do it. And when she turns around and yeah. she's looking, she'd be like. <laughs> I don't know. I would probably, I don't know. I would probably say either Corinne or Coco just because they were really competitive dancers. But I would also say Karis just because I know her super well and she's just always 
doing the most <laughs> athletic stuff always. <laughs> that That's factual. That's not that I would probably say either Aiden or Corinne. Corinne, she's really mean when it comes to it. It's, it's hilarious. <laughs> yes, Corinne. You are, <laughs> she is pretty competitive. She though. is. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this, subscribe to Seventeen's YouTube channel. Bye, guys.